What's that right there? That little house. So it is currently Wednesday, Tuesday, Wednesday, I think. I am so off on my days, but it is currently Wednesday. It is already a little after one o'clock and I decided to start vlogging. And now I went to Walmart and I ended up doing a shop with me video. I did not plan on doing it, but I originally was supposed to go to Target. I needed to pick up a few things, but I wanted to go to Walmart because I saw Ashley from Till Back into his part and then also Kaylin Cash, they were posting about these really cute leopard tennis shoes that they said they got at Walmart on clearance for $5. So I was in a hunt for them. I did find them, but my Walmart didn't have them on clearance. I even tried looking online to see if they were priced at $5 because then they can just price match, but I couldn't even find them online. So I did not pick them up because they were still full price, which I think was like $11. So I'm gonna wait a week or two and see if they ever go on clearance. And if they do, I'll pick them up. If not, I'm going back because I'm going to try to insert a picture, but they had some really cute other like leopard cheetah print shoes, but they were black and white and like gray, I think, and they would just match with more and those were full price as well. So I think I might go back for those. They were really cute, but I want to show you guys really quickly. I did pick up myself another pair of shoes um, that were on clearance. They're like a blushy pink color. I also got Madison a pair of shoes because they're almost the same color as mine, so we can match with each other if i can even get this up i'm having trouble here all right everything's gonna fall over all right so they are these slip-ons and like i said it's like a blushy pink color and it's so comfortable it is the avia brand and i do have a lot of their workout clothes like from that line and it's really great quality so i picked them up they were only nine dollars so i picked up those for me and then for madison i picked up her these shoes these were on clearance for five dollars and as you guys can see it's a similar color to mine except hers is a little bit darker but it's still like that blush pink color 
This is a size 10. They only had two left in a size 10, so it is a little big on her, but that's fine. I also picked her up a dress. I figured Valentine's is coming up and it has hearts on it. And it was on clearance for $5, so I figured why not? I'll just put some like tights underneath because it is a dress, but look how cute that is. Do you want to say hi, princess? You want to say hi? No? Okay. But it's just this dress and it's really cute. It has a ton of different hearts and it was on clearance for $5. So I figured I would just grab that as well. But Madison did stay home from school today and yesterday because she's having her GI issues. I actually had to pick her up early on Monday from school because of it. So hopefully yeah. she can go back tomorrow. But I'm about to get some lunch for me and Madison and then head out to pick up Ryan from school. No basketball today, but Madison does have therapy. so. That is the plan for today. I also I also want to do my nails. I showed you guys those fake nails on Instagram that I want to try out. Um, I opened it so all the nails have fallen over, but it's by Pretty Woman. It's these nails. So I think I'm going to do these nails today as well. And that will be the day. I'm just going to do my nails, eat some lunch, take Madison to therapy, pick up Brian from school. I already worked out. I went to the gym earlier today and I went to Walmart, but I didn't vlog while I was in Walmart just because I filmed a shot with me, but anyways enough of my rambling i want to jump on here really quickly i did vlog maybe one or two minutes um over the weekend we went to the park so i'll probably insert those clips maybe before this or after i'm not sure i'll insert it in this vlog but anyways let's get some lunch and then we gotta get brother okay do you want to say hi to everyone you're being such a good girl today you are so good at walmart i'm so proud of you are you drinking water what are you drinking you ready for lunch mm -hmm. yeah okay let's get some lunch princess so it is a much later i am doing horrible with vlogging it is pretty much four o'clock it's 3 56 right now i already picked up ryan from school and i was gonna film myself doing my nails and then i finished doing my nails and i completely forgot that i wanted to film myself but if you guys follow me over on instagram i did show you guys mm -hmm. that i went to five below and i picked up these nails mm -hmm. they're by pretty woman i usually do the kiss nails but I decided to try these out just because they were only $5 and they had a lot of different designs. So this is how it looks. I did have to cut and file it down just because they were just way too long for my liking. So I did cut them and then file them. And then I did use the Kiss glue um, just because I really like that glue. So we'll see how long they last. That's how they look right now. Um, the Kiss nails usually last me about a week to a week and a half if I'm lucky sometimes two weeks but it's really rare it's usually like about a week a week and a half so we'll see how long these last i will say they are much thinner than the kiss nails if you guys buy the kiss nails and do them those are um more thicker so these are definitely much thinner than the kiss nails but i guess we'll see how long they last i don't know if they are going to last that long since they're super thin but we'll see they might surprise me but they're really pretty on so i'm liking them so far so that's how they look. I'm out of breath because I've been folding laundry and stuff, but Madison's just laying down on the kitchen floor. My house is a mess. I need to clean it up. I need to put the dishes away. I need to start cooking an early dinner because Madison has um, therapy. I have so much to do and I don't feel like doing anything. I'm so tired. I've already had like two cups of coffee and I feel like it's not doing anything to me. I think I'm just so used to caffeine, but Sorry that this vlog is another like chit chat style vlog, but I completely forget to vlog and pick up the camera. But I guess I'll start cleaning. Maybe I'll do a little cleaning montage and then I'll probably be ready to go to therapy. So we will see you guys in a little Ryan. You haven't even seen Ryan yet. He's upstairs watching Godzilla or something. I have no clue, but what are you doing? You're so cute. Do you want to tell everyone what you discovered? The refrigerator water yeah so madison discovered how to get water from the fridge so now she presses the water and there's water all over my floor i have to clean that up as well so i'm gonna start cleaning up really quickly and then i'll see you guys in a little once i take madison probably to therapy
Your books? What are you watching? It's a, it's a cartoon that's pencil. So it's a pencil? Yeah, it's a cartoon that's like somebody drew it. Alright, well, we gotta go take the city therapy. We have five minutes, so you need to be downstairs in five minutes, okay? Okay. Alright, so we are at Madison's therapy right now, but we are about five, six minutes early, so I'm gonna sit in the car for a little bit and then head in. Yay! I want to show you something. Ryan was drawing something. You want to show them? Yes, but it's not the eyeball I showed you earlier. It's something else. What is it? Ooh, is that a dinosaur? No. Godzilla? Did you say Godzilla? Yes. Yes. Oh, here's a closer look. Wait, can Ooh. I get... Wait, I'm gonna give it a closer, closer look, but I'm gonna make a city around it. Well, you make that city, buddy. Okay. All right, so like I said, we have like five or six minutes left. Um, I didn't get to clean up the house as much as I wanted to. I didn't realize that I only had like 30 minutes and I needed to get the kids some dinner before we left because by the time we get back home, it'll be around 6.30 and the kids by the time is like at 7.20. So I always feed them dinner before we go to therapy. So I was only able to do... <laughs> What's so funny? It is funny. Apparently something's funny. But um, I was only able to clean up the kitchen, but at least I was able to get that out of the way. As long as I have a clean kitchen and my bed is made, I am a happy person. So I was able to clean up the kitchen. Once I get back home, I just have to clean up the dining room. And then that's it. Tomorrow's when I'll do my deep cleaning, like cleaning the bathroom, sweeping, mopping, vacuuming, stuff like that. So I don't mind too much that I couldn't get everything done because I'm going to be deep cleaning tomorrow anyways. But I think this is going to be almost the end of the vlog because we honestly don't have much left to do. Now I made the city. Can I show that? I see. Wait, wait. I'm going to get a little closer. Mm -hmm. Well, if you put it too close, and nothing to see. All right, that's cute. Like I said, this is probably going to be towards the end of the vlog because we're not really going to be doing much more. That's exciting. So I apologize about this vlog probably being boring, but honestly, sometimes I really don't do much. I could have vlogged when I was at Walmart, but I did a shop with me, so that's why I didn't vlog when I was in there. And then also when I went to the gym. I didn't vlog there either. I guess it could have gotten one or two clips there, but I didn't think about it. I didn't plan on vlogging, so I just picked up the camera once I got home. But anyways, enough of my rambling. We're gonna bring Madison in and then just hang out for 30 minutes. She only has 30 minutes today, and then um, we can head back home. So I'll see you guys in a little. Ready for therapy? Maddie, you ready for therapy? Mommy. You took off your shoes. You gotta clean up this car. The kids bring so much stuff into this car and they never bring it back out. Yeah, like that toy that you're holding, buddy. All right, let's go. Maddie. Madison. You fixing the train? Madison's super hyper. What do you have there? You're gonna make a train? Maddie, are you ready for therapy? Gonna have a good day? Maddie, she's ignoring me. Are you excited, Maddie? <laughs> At least she's in a good mood and she's not cranky. All right, so we are home. Um, I'm about to take the kids a bath. Well, Ryan will take a shower on his own, but I need to take Madison a bath. But I want to show you guys really quickly. If you guys have kids, babies, um, 
and they either have eczema or they have a horrible like bite, like a bug bite, or they have like rashes from diapers. This Aveeno is awesome. So Madison, she has GI issues. For anyone who has followed me for a while knows that my daughter has a lot of GI issues and I've, we've seen so many doctors and every doctor just says it's very common in autistic kids. We haven't gotten to the bottom of what causes her to have all these GI issues, but because of that, she does get um, a lot of rashes sometimes. She hasn't had one for months, thankfully. And I was so happy because there was one point she was getting a rash like every other week. And it's been a few months since she had her last one, but she does have one now. So I usually give her a oatmeal bath whenever she does because this helps soothe her and it makes her feel better. So I bought this from Walmart, but you can get it from like Target or Walgreens or anything. They also have a baby one um, that's like for sensitive skin. I usually get that one, but they were out. So I just grabbed this one. So this is just Aveeno Soothing Bath Treatment and it's dermatologist recommended. So it's also fragrance free. So I would just share that with you guys really quickly. So I'm gonna go get the kids in the bath. I also wanna show you guys our rowing machine. If you watched my last vlog, I'm sorry, Stark. If you guys watched my last vlog, my husband decided to buy a rowing machine and it is here in the living room. I did it the other day, it's right here. It's really small. It's not like the traditional rowing machine because those are thousands of dollars and we don't have that much money, but it's really dark. Let me see if I can flip the camera around. All right, there we go. The lighting is better like that. But um, this is the rowing machine we got and all of the ones we saw online are super expensive. They're like a few thousand dollars. So this one was pretty cheap. I think it was under a hundred dollars. It might've been like around $90. Madison, what are you doing? Don't do that. <laughs> but yeah, it's really, it's a really good workout um machine for at home. So yeah, it's just a really good workout machine to have at home. So I did use it over the weekend on Saturday. I actually filmed a at-home workout and also my protein shake. I'm not sure if that'll be up before this vlog, but if it is, I'll link it down below. If not, it'll be up soon. But I don't usually go to the gym on the weekends just because there's only, I think, two camp times on Saturday and then they're closed on Sundays. And Ryan has a basketball game pretty much every Saturday, so I can't go to Saturday games or Saturday um camps so i did that on the weekend but that's also good for days when madison stays home from school and she's super sick and i can't bring her to the daycare at gym i at least have a rowing machine to do and then i can do like a quick um workout video on the tv and that'll be like my workout so i'm glad my husband got that he's been using it as well and the great like full body workout and you definitely feel it i only do maybe about 15 minutes of it and i'm done but Anyways, and if my rambling, Madison's showing her stomach in the background, I'm gonna go take her bath, use that Aveeno um, bath to help soothe her because she has a little rash. Maddie, Maddie, are you ready to take a bath? Are you ready to take a bath? Thankfully, they already ate dinner. It is almost seven o'clock, so they already ate dinner. I'm gonna go ahead and get them in the bath, get them in their pajamas, and then that is going to end the vlog. Pretty sure I'm going to just end it here. I don't think I will pick up the camera again. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you did, please remember to give it a thumbs up. Also subscribe and turn on your notification bell if you have not already. I would love to have you be a part of my YouTube family. I think for my next vlog, I might do another like day in the life. The past few vlogs I've done, I've combined a few days together. Um, So I think the next one I will do a day in the life of maybe a special needs mom. I've only done one of those here on my channel. So maybe that'll be my next vlog, which I don't know when I'll vlog again, but we will see. Anyways, I love you guys and I will see you guys next time.